foodies. I am Rosewood Benitez, your chef mom. Join me for another round of 10-Minute Kitchen Wonders here on Quick Fire, your step-by-step -step guide to everyday delicious meals for the busy you. And for today, we have as our guest, Ms. Manilyn Reynes. Hi! Hi! Hi. <laughs> How are Hi. you? Thank okay, you. so what can I do for you today? Um, actually, I'll tell you that I'm Okay. That's why we always have that in our house. And of course, I put it in anything, in everything. Oh, no, all of them are really hard to put it in. And of the things that are put in the table. Oh, oh, it's dip. Oh, oh. Okay, side dish. I just want to be able to cook something else. Na, na, using the house pa rin, to serve ko sa children, ko, pero medyo different naman siya. Uh, That's the usual na natitikman nila. So, ano ba ang specialty mo? Binagoong nga. Binagoong nga. Siyempre, okay. ano oh. yan. So, gusto mong gamitin ko yung bagoong sa isa pa ba ng iba namang recipe. So, ano? Ah, okay so, naman. Meron talaga akong madaling recipe for you. Meron? Well, less than 10 minutes gawa na. Wait, oh, 10 minutes. No? Okay, okay. Yeah. so just sit back, relax, and I'll be back in less than 10 minutes. <laughs> For Ms. Manilyn na mahilig sa bagoong, meron na naman akong bagong recipe kung saan pwede niyang gamitin ang kanyang favorite na ingredient. Kunin ko lang aking fresh crisp lettuce, my sweet ham, and my fresh eggs. Ngayon baka naman yung mga tao nagtataka, bakit ba Caesar salad ang gagawin ko? Bakit nga ba itong naisipan kong gawin? It's one of my favorite na recipes. Favorite salad recipe ko to, even if I go to a restaurant, yun ang una-una kong ino-order. And I have a very fond memory of this kasi when I was younger, my mom made this um, salad for us. And she was asking us, oh, parang when we tasted this, oh, how, how is it? And tapos hindi naman namin masabi na sobrang ala talaga nung salad. Na parang kaming dalawang magkapatid, nagtitingin na na parang, baka ganito yung lasa nung salad. Tapos, siyempre, I was eight or seven that time. Inaral ko, bakit nga ba? Ano bang meron dun sa salad ni Mami? Ba't siya umalat? Yun pala, I discovered na ang gamit niya dun ay eh, napakaraming anchovies. So, kaya ito Pinoy style na Caesar salad dahil instead of anchovies, ang gagamitin ko naman ay ang favorite Miss Manila na bagoong. So, we have your hot pan. Just put a little bit of olive oil just to coat our pan. Ang Caesar salad kasi, what they use ay mga breadcrumbs. Mga breadcrumbs are like yung mga croutons. So instead of croutons, ang croutons naman is just American bread that you deep fry. So instead of American bread, ang gagamitin ko ay yung ating favorite na pandesal. Siyempre naman, hindi yan mawawala sa favorite ng mga Pinoy ang pandesal, di ba? Dahil tayo pagka breakfast, we always look for pandesal. Talagang mainit na mainit, kahit na kape lang, and pandesal, gusto na natin yon. So ang gagawin nyo dito, ayan, chop ko lang siya, just like yung mga crouton, crouton size. Just use the upper part. Ayan, just cube lang natin siya. Ang Caesar salad is made by, um, ginawa siya ng isang Italian chef na si Cesar Cardini. Kaya siya tinawa, tinawag na Caesar salad. Pinangalan niya sa kanyang salad na yun. Lagyan na natin nating pandasal para matos. Ngayon, meron ako dito ang Chinese ham. Pwede kayong gumamit ng ordinary ham. Para ito naman mag-serve as our meat for the salad. Um, ngayon, marami na kasi mga varieties for the Caesar salad. Traditionally, ang meron lang dyan, yung lettuce leaves, tsaka yung kanyang sauce, yung Caesar salad um, sauce. Pero yung iba ngayon, nilalagyan na nila ng shrimps, ng prawns, ng grilled chicken. So instead of using that, ito naman aking gagamitin, ang ating ham. So let's just slice this. So, asama na natin to with our pandesal. At kung nandito kayo, maamoy nyo to talaga kung gaano kabango itong... Ito palang ham, palang yan, tsaka pandesal. Gagawin na natin ang ating salad dressing. Kailangan natin ng dalawang egg yolks. So, I have here two eggs. I-separate natin ngayon yung egg yolks from the egg whites. Meron akong tip for you watchers kasi maraming nahihirapan kung paano nila isi-separate yung egg yolks from the egg whites. Ako, what I do is, ayan, I crack it and put the entire egg sa bowl. And what I do is I just use my hand and just make sure that your hands are clean, ha? Ayan, see? Talagang buong-buo yung ating egg yolk. We can now put it into our other bowl. Okay, let me just get some garlic. We need around mga siguro mga one, one tablespoon of this one. Mahi, medyo mahirap talagang balita ng garlic. So meron din ako isa pang tip para sa inyong mga viewers. What you can do is, mag-heat kayo ng water, not boiling. Lagay niyo lang dun yung inyong garlic, buong garlic. And then you let it stay for mga 5 to 6 seconds and you stir it around. 
And then you take it out, tapos ilagay niyo siya bigla sa ice bath. Or basta tanggalin niyo siya from the hot water, drain it out. Then put it in a bowl na merong ice water. And then let it stand for like mga 5 to 10 minutes. Tapos mas madali nang matanggal ng balat ang ating garlic. So let's just mix this together. Kuha naman tayo ng kalamansi kasi usually ang ginagamit for Caesar salad is lemon juice. But since nga ito ay Pinoy style, gamit tayo ng sariling atin ng kalamansi. So, kailangan lang natin ng acid and garlic. Yan ang talagang uh, mga staples ng salad, Caesar salad dressing. Ang garlic, ang egg yolks, ang acid, and the oil. Yan. Kailangan rin natin ng mustard. Pwede kayong gumamit ng table mustard or American mustard na mabibili nyo sa inyong groceries. We just need uh, one teaspoon of this. For putting mustard kasi, it has a very strong flavor na makakasarap ng ating salad. And not just that, it's an emulsifying agent. Ang emulsifying agent, baka magtataka kayo, ano naman ang emulsifying agent? It combines two opposing ingredients together, katulad ng oil and water. So, nagyan natin ng, syempre, ang ating highlight na ating recipe, ang ating bagoong. Kailangan natin ng mga one tablespoon of this. At syempre, ang ating pampasarap, ang ating Ajinomoto Umami Super Seasoning. Diba? Para mas lumasang ating salad dressing. Ang Ajinomoto Umami Super Seasoning is made through fermentation. And fermentation is known to create very delicious food, katulad ng wine, ng beer, pati ng ating bagoong. Lahat to nag-undergo ng fermentation. So, just like Ajinomoto, kaya naman malalaman nyo na talagang sobrang masarap at malasa ito. Yan, okay na to. We're now gonna put our canola oil. Slowly pour it and whisk it para mag-combine yung ating ingredients. Ito yung sinasabi kong emulsifying agent ang mustard. Kasi makikita nyo, walang separation of the oil from the water or from the liquid. We have your crisp lettuce. Ayan, let's just separate it using my hands. Mas maganda na you use your hands when you're separating lettuce leaves. Kasi ang tendency, if you use knife, nagbabrown yung edges ng ating lettuce leaves and we don't want that. So it's much better if you use your hands. Pwede na kayong gumamit ng iba pang klaseng lettuce leaves. Pwede kayong gumamit ng romaine. Ito at ginagamit ko ngayon yung iceberg na mas common para sa ating mga mommies, di ba? Ikunin na natin ang ating toasted pandesal and ham. Put it on our lettuce leaves. Kunin na natin ang ating Caesar salad dressing. Let's just put it on top. Yung ibang tao, mahilig sila parang lumalangoy sa sauce sa dressing ang kanilang salad. Me, I prefer it na parang konti lang talaga. Medyo basa lang ang aking greens. So, depende yan sa preference ng inyong guest. And for final touches, let's just grate our sharp cheddar cheese. Makikita nyo, malalaman nyo kung sharp cheddar cheese ang ginagamit nyo by the color. Kasi the milder ones are... Parang mas pale ang color nila dito. Yellow, pale yellow. Well, this one is like more on the orange side. And there you have it, our Pinoy-style Caesar salad. Sana magustuhan ito ni Manolin. Okay, there you have it, our Pinoy-style Caesar salad. Mm. Sorry, Daya. <laughs> wag muna ang Daya yun. Sino ba yun? Wag muna, wag muna. So, yung bagoong na favorite mo, ginamit okay. ko for the dressing. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, try and it. And then, ano to? Uh, pandesal na. Yeah, meron tayo dyang pandesal. Instead of crutons, ginamit ko pandesal. Para Pinoy talaga siya. Talagang ninanam na mo yung dish. <laughs> <laughs> Talagang ninanam nam. Masarap siya. <laughs> Masarap siya talaga. Okay. Pangalawa, tamang-tama yung timpla. Tamang-tama yung timpla. Hindi siya sobrang... Maalat, hindi yes. na natin mm -hmm. na. Pero hindi rin naman nawala yung alat niya. Yes. Okay. Sa tingin mo ba, Pepper pasado ito. yan? Yes. Oo naman. Pasado ba? Sa akin, oo. Sa mga bata, oo. Eh, madali lang yan. May impress mo siya dyan. Kaya ko. Diba? Kaya mo yan. Ang bilis ba, 10 minutes yes. lang? Less than 10 minutes yan. Oh. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you so much, Ms. Thank Madeline. You. Maraming salamat. And of course, we'd like to thank Bika Cookware, Princess Appliances, Royal Dalton, Elba Cooker, Savers Appliance Depot, and Sari of Benefit Style Salon. Create gourmet dishes with bagoong gamit ang umami ng Ajinomoto. This has been Ruth but Benitez, your chef mom. Join me for another round of your 10-minute kitchen wonders only here on Quickfire. Sarap, sarap.